Yo, welcome, welcome, welcome back to the channel. Man, it's July 8th, man, 2020. Hope y'all had a good day because today was a good day to get stuff done. I'm telling you, man, because on this channel, we lock in, get better, and we vibe out. We got some real good topics today, some good news. I'm going to introduce news on here today. So we're going to start it off like this. First topic of news for the day is Patrick Mahomes. Man, it's, it, I always find it intriguing to see other people winning. It feels good to see other people winning, man. Patrick Mahomes inked a 10-year deal. If y'all don't know, he's the, the Super Bowl winning quarterback of, of the Kansas City Chiefs, man. Does amazing things. But, man, 10-year, $450 million? That's ridiculous. Your children's children, children gonna eat off of that. I mean, we, we, we got people winning everywhere. You just saw Kanye ink a, a 10-year deal with Gap. 10 years, but that's a decade. And you straight. But anyway, man, that's amazing, man. And also, bro, we got some other news, man. Kevin Durant in 2016 put a million dollars into Postmates. A couple days ago, Uber just bought Postmates, turned his 1 million to 15 million. 15 X return. Crazy on an M. People out here winning. And I know, you know what I'm saying, you may not have to be Kevin Durant or Patrick Mahomes to get a win or Kanye, but. Shit, you can get wins in your life, too. Shit, you see other people win, there ain't no reason why you can't. Because <laughs> I'm definitely looking to win. But anyways, anyways, man, we're about to get into this topic today. What's the topic for today? The topic for today is, you're not ready until you're ready. So what am I talking about? Let's say they got a person who wants to change their habits and start going to the gym cool well the first thing that has to happen is they have to make that decision in their mind that they want to go to the gym then they got to do the hard part it's changing their habits and start going so that's that's people's hardest thing is, is getting something going you know going to the gym or starting this new diet or starting this class getting that degree that's the hardest part is getting started and you're not gonna start till you're ready so what does it take to get ready? Well, that's, that's an interesting question, but I, I came up with a solution and I realized you're not going to be ready till you're mentally ready. How do you become mentally ready? You have to see yourself doing that thing in your head every day. Every day. So if you're a person who's never been to the gym and you want to start going to the gym, until you start mentally seeing yourself in the gym every day, your, your mental is not going to start making those connections on how to put that into real life or how to make that reality. And when I say make that reality, I don't mean on no spiritual or whatever. It's just what triggers your mind into saying, I want to go to the gym into it's time to go to the gym. See what I'm saying? So you're not going to be ready till you're ready. I, I, I heard something crazy the other day. It was like, uh, I can't remember who said it, so I, I, I don't know who to give credit to, but that said... You can't be a millionaire until you're ready to be a millionaire. And I was like, damn, that's that's some real stuff right there. Because if, if, if you take a regular person who's not a millionaire, throw them a million dollars, and they still have non-millionaire habits, they won't be a millionaire for long. You take somebody who's never been to the gym and, and make them go for a solid week, they're, they're not going to keep those habits up. They have to mentally get there in their heads where they see themselves going every day in order to keep those habits up. And that's a serious thing. So you should think about that once you once you start realizing certain goals you want, instead of just thinking, I want to be rich. Or wh whatever you want to do. I want to write that book. I want to I wanna start that garden. You have to see yourself starting that garden every day before something, I don't know what it is, inside compels you to say, you know what? I'm gonna go buy some go buy some fertilizer today. I'm gonna go to Home Depot. I'm gonna go to Lowe's. That's that connection. So you're never ready till you're ready. So in my personal life, like why am I just now starting a YouTube? Well, I, I wasn't ready. And I, I said in my early 20s, I'm 26, so I said around 21, 22, I wanted to start a YouTube. Why has it been five years? I wasn't ready. If, if I would have started back then, I promise you I would have not uploaded consistently out of put up one or two videos and let it die and I'm pretty sure you 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 may have the same problem yourself you may start a diet and do it for one or two weeks and then you let it die or you may go to the gym and go 
once, maybe a month, maybe two months, and then you let it die. Especially with New Year's resolutions, never do those. Those are bad. That just they they start off in a bad mind state. But you have to leave mentally get there first in order for it to stick. You can easily trick yourself into going to the gym two or three times for two three weeks, or or you know cooking maybe twice in that one week, but you'll be eating back out soon again. And the point is, you want to stick with these habits. So, in conclusion, like the first thing you do is make that decision in your mind that you want to do something. The second thing you do, and the most important, and, and the part that's getting you ready, is you have to mentally see yourself there. And what does that do? That changes your thoughts and that changes your patterns to, to, to get your mind thinking, how are you going to get there? Instead of, I want. Most people just love dreaming. Let's keep it G. Most people love dreaming seeing themselves in the gym. Most people love dreaming seeing themselves rich. And it does feel good to dream. But uh, my personal opinion, it feels a little bit better to, to strive and get there. And even the pain it takes to strive and get to your goals feels way better than doing nothing at all. So that's my little two cents on that. So whatever you want to do, mentally get there first and mentally see yourself doing that. And that way you'll be able to form habits to where you can stick and pretty much do anything you want to do. It's worked for me. Hope it works for you. So that's it for the day. If you like what you heard, you want to join the cohort, you want to join the family where we come here, we get better every day. And we just discuss and rap. And we have interactive conversations. The more comments y'all drop, the more topics we got to discuss. And we're going to keep getting better every day. One.